it's your boy Chris with the next all right so today I just want to talk about loving yourself being yourself now I know I talk about this topic a lot but um one of Rihanna's quotes that she said on the uh, I forgot what a sh uh, award show but I just saw the clips of it and she said once you learn to love your to be yourself you never want to be anybody else and that you know I can relate to because like when I was a teenager or just in general you know um, song, a pink song don't let me get me that was kind of like my theme song kind of my anthem because you know you feel like you're being depressed you feel like you're going through things and you just want to be somebody else you want the life of, of somebody else even if it's just for one day and you never know other people could be going through st stuff that's familiar to you too so if somebody is you know just try to help them out try to be there for them you know the thing that we all I think go through loneliness and through judgment we go through a lot of heartache but uh, one of the things that keep us separated is our egos when you locked inside the prisons of your pride when you have your standards too high you know those things can keep you um, it, those things can keep you down and it, it could really hinder you you know you should uh, never I mean like I see it's not bad to have standards or whatever but it should never hinder you just to be you know all alone first of all the most the best relationship you ever gonna have with yourself is you that's the first foremost well with God and then second with you you know that's the most important relationship you should have with yourself because you live with you 24 7 all day every day you know even if you live with somebody else you know you still have to be happy and content with being yourself because it may seem minuscule but one of the hardest things you ever do in life is be yourself you know take it from an expert you know you get judged you, um, you know sometimes you know you're too black then you're not black enough then you know I, I get all these stupid comments or whatever but you know it doesn't really phase me I don't care about it because I'm doing me I'm trying to help out other people do the exact same thing if you want to be miserable and fake go be miserable and fake in your own corner because it's not hindering me it's not doing anything <clears throat> to my life I know how to uh, bounce and get rid of people you know if I could stop talking to somebody um, for about five years family included then I can do the same to you either come to me correct or don't come at me at all because it again you know it is um, the people you hang around with is detrimental to your life you know you always got to know who is there for you you got to watch out who says um, hating comments in a joking way and you have to um, you know just worry about yourself uh, whatever journey whatever career path you're trying to go on you know follow that whoever is trying to um, whoever a real friend who's ever trying to use you for what you got <clears throat> will eventually show themselves and they show themselves up and when people show themselves they your know, true they true colors don't go paint a different picture you know so just um, being yourself you know having a relationship with yourself being a content with yourself being alone is all the things that you need to do to be successful to be happy and it's the first foremost thing important you don't always need friends or people there to um, be there for you because if you're not really happy with yourself then when somebody tries to compliment you you ain't gonna believe that shit <laughs> you know you always gonna try to find reasons to why they saying that but when you're happy with yourself, when you get in your feelings, but then you realize who you are, that's the best feeling in the world. So I just want to comment on, you know, Rihanna's comment when she said that, because it's real true, you know. We all go through things, but we can get through this. All right. So that's all I, I got to say is Chris with the next, you know. You know, I get judged all the time, and as you can see, but again, you know, I let people's negativity go in one ear and out the other. Not even that. I don't take nothing to heart. 
especially if you never had a place a place there in the first place all right this has been your boy chris with the next peace well my hat fell off yes all right, you always gonna get negative comments and um stupid uh, people saying hate and shit when they can't do what you can do you know some people are just damn miserable just like the internet 90 percent of the internet is miserable you got the five percent that get on log on and get off and have a life and have a nice day then you got the 90 percent that just scouring the internet just trying to make people miserable like they are and what i got to say about that is get yourself some damn help get a hobby bitch